everyone, and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Republic. So it's already hours in. With what? One more planet to go? Or, yeah, about one more planet. So we still going to go back to Yellow 4, and I don't think we can go back to Dantui anymore, so, yeah. Hey there. Well... Oh, we can actually talk about this? It seems to me that if you don't really remember anything about being Revan, then it doesn't really matter anymore. You are who you are now, right? So it doesn't bother I don't see the Sith Lord standing here. I see a friend who's been with us through thick and thin. Remember, Malik's the one who tried to destroy Terrace. See? Mission's fine. Hey there. Us. Okay, you constantly talk to her about this if you want to. I've made my peace with... So, is there anything... I don't know anything about Korriban, but I get a bad feeling in this place. If there's such a thing as an evil planet, this is it. Sorry I can't be more help, you know. Is there anything else I can do for you? Now yes, remember Korriban. Ancient homeworld of the Sith. That and then there was a true Sith. Which this game is not going to address. Well, I guess it addressed the true Sith at one point. As mostly extinct and stuff. But yeah. Okay. So I actually just repeats things, mostly. So we want car, and we want HK. Cause car's son is here. We have to find him. Oh, so the fact that car's son comes a dark Jedi is a bit concerning. So convenient that you know, Car has no force affinity. Yet his son does. Also, there's entirely too many terminals, and far from me. Just a bit. It's like all these terminals. Can <laughs> Kuya mi juz kachita naipatoga ya fulki kukula jit. Ui, ita nadan na jit ya. You know they would be. Kuya mi juz kachita naipatoga ya fulki kukula. Achota. Ta bistio bon konki pangpa. Ching palajis kamuli, tu ni rana no prata dunk no sarcha doma wama kun bestoma. Tong hai tuam jiji yumalith pa ang inko tu. Tolba da bunk wat. Ta bistio bon konki pangpa. Ching palajis kamuli, tu ni rana no prata dunk no sarcha doma wama. Ako ci copa, ci non mulirà king pad. Mucha sh. Okay. There's the thing. I think we may have to end up coming back to Corva because I believe there was a certain NPC that shows up. It's like, hey, I know you're Evan. Go to Corva and talk to this guy. He'll give you some some shit. No, that is the wrong answer. Again, you pathetic hopefuls can't possibly all be this stupid, can you? What a wama mulira, king kunjo peshak, no ba mulira. I'm no master yet, but I like the sound of that. All right, one more question. Though a lot of you is trying my patience. All right, let's say you become a Sith and I am your commanding officer. I give you an order to spare the life of an enemy. Do you do it? Oh, of course, Shardan. Anything you command us. We would never oppose you. No, no, no. 
<sighs> Do you honestly believe that the Sith are in need of such sniveling cowards? Mercy is a weakness. If your leader shows weakness, it is your duty to kill him and show true authority, true power. That is why the Sith are strong. Tunipudu! Rana no prata dunk no sercha! It's you a penki! No, you don't understand, and you probably never will. You wouldn't survive five seconds in the academy, the other students would tear you apart. Bah! I can't be bothered with fools. Perhaps I should, um... You, Jedi, you're looking to get in the Academy, are you not? Well, of course you are. Why else would you be here? Let me pose a question to you. These hopefuls will never survive in the Academy. A lesson must be taught here, but I am at a loss as to what form it should take. Advisement. Evisceration works well. Electrocution and blunt trauma also work well, I understand. I wasn't talking to you. I'm thinking to spare them the effort of being killed and do it myself. Perhaps I shall turn their skin inside out. Or force lightning, yes, it's a most impressive display. Well, perhaps a bit of humiliation is in order. I could easily strip off their tunics and make them run through the colony. Or they could lose all control of their bodily functions. What do you think? I just can't seem to decide. I wonder if those aren't even options. Please, tell him to let us go, I beg you! Silence. Why not ask you? I'm rather exhausted from dealing with hopefuls like these. I can barely think straight. Besides, I find it fun. Come now, a decision, please. No, no, maybe. You do? Hmm. Perhaps having a bunch of hopefuls soiling themselves would be somewhat amusing. Let's see, shall we? Well, they didn't soil themselves, so I don't know how that was amusing. Uchuapenki, we need weapons. Jiska dosoki, kopa bono nakachu, labora na winkis, chiwi aita ka tong chicha, baba hasan shan. Kakin cha na wabaka on. So he has weapons and weapons. Nothing we really need, but yeah, that's all he has, really. Well, we could go here to our cell list. Because remember, we have all the cell stuff. Like, we don't really need all these giant master robes. And, the problem though is they're not even really worth much, are they? Let's see, like, yeah. Like, I don't, also don't need all these. I definitely don't need that. Keep the Mandalorian on just cause. Stump it on. Long sword. Good morning, answers, which aren't worth anything, apparently. Now I'll give the Gina Harden things. I can't even sell the Gina Harden armor, apparently. Huh, weird. Do I have short lightsabers? Yes, I do. Crystals, crystals. To harden blasters. To the crappy blasters. Oh, 
grenades now. Don't need that. Don't need that. Keep the visor, even though I don't really care for it. And then there's these. Alright, so don't really need those. Constitution plus four, though, huh? Not sure who to give that to. Well, I we have two hair triggers, so we could technically upgrade Karth's thing, but yeah. That would require me to go back to the ship. And then there's all these things to sort through. Ugh. I don't really need to buy anything at this point. Again. Look here, my dear friends. We have some newcomers to the colony. Led by a Jedi, no less. I don't believe I've seen any of them before, have you? I hate Jedi, and these fallen ones are worse. They always get into the academy, and they think they're better than the rest of us. Great. Just what we needed. Some punks to come steal our lunch credits. <laughs> smart mouth newcomers to boot. Looks pretty fresh to me, Lashow. That's what I thought. Well, stranger, I don't know whether you're aware of this or not, but here on Korriban, the Sith do as they please. And we are Sith. Quite literally, whether you live or die depends upon our whim. What do you think of that, hmm? You can always try to kill me. You'd fail. You Commentary. Try. That's the way to tell the meatbags, Master. Charging weapons just in case. This should be fun. Those are very brave words for such an insignificant person. Do you not realize how many Sith are here in Dreshde? Is this a raffle? How many guesses do we get? Let me kill this one, Lasho. Let me do it. Now, now, let's not be hasty. Perhaps our friend here could yet offer up some amusement. What do you say? Amuse us, make us laugh, and we might just consider allowing you to live. Yeah, we go to meet them by being a, you know who I am, a dark friend. What? <laughs> I think someone just stood up to you, Lasho. Shut up, fool, unless you want to be next. Yeah? Anytime. Stop it. This is boring. Let's just go back to the academy. Fine, we'll go. As for you, I'll find you later. Trust me on that. Yeah, I could easily just... Just like that. I'm just here on one of Zerka's transports. I don't have no business with you. Hi, Central Representative. Hmm. Aren't you the human who won the swoop race on Manan? Congratulations and well done. It was most exciting to watch. It is an honor to have you in our offices. How may Zerka serve you? That's all you do. We do some mining here and are responsible for local shipping and support of the Sith on Korriban. Our starport is mostly just freighters and such, but we do get many travelers that come here to learn from the Sith. I must say, Zerka is in need of droids right now. That's a mighty fine-looking one you have there. Objection. This unit is not for sale, meatbag. Uh, yes, of course. No offense meant. <laughs> Touchy, isn't it? This office is actually our administrative headquarters for this region. Rather inauspicious, isn't it? We offer good prices here to those traders that keep the colony supplied. If you're in need of anything, this is the place to come. You certainly can. Allow me to punch up our stock. Well, so at this point in the game, we'll be probably worth buying. Hmm. That's a translate by a suit. I mean, that's not terrible, but not that great either. Do you need to have a lot of armor? Let's 
scares and demo plus sets. Especially if I wanted to wear gauntlets to, you know, pick up those mines. <laughs> sure, why not? Ooh, Okay, so... Now all I have to do is remember to switch to these when I want to pick up explosives. Fun times. Anyway. Citizen, citizen, set, citizen, guard. New loot. Dispatcher Sif. I've had two friends killed by the Sith already. It must be some kind of test. I'll survive and make it into the Academy. I know it. One of Korriban's primary trade routes went through Terrace. Now that it's destroyed. Yeah, remember Terrace is not that. Well, I guess it is a bit far. How are you? You look important. Who are you? Uchua Penki, Tony Tuama G, Human Ak Un Ikatune, Chi Ita Kanki, Chana Kilikon. Yeah. Tong Hi Tuama Aki Inkotune, or Tong Hi Tuama G Aki Inkotu, Chi Wi Aita Ka Chong Chi Cha, Agi Inkotune. Just crunk it up at Slimo, Chi Ita Kang. เดี๋ยวเซฟเซฟมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเซฟเลยมาเ
Ni kaba dubaka, patisa, patisa, kon muli slimo po i wanga kun uba baska duana chichopa muska, kimba ni chalora kun kiyuma patmalia u patoga yak fuli kukala jiji, tingkuin kuka, tanghit wana jis. Jiska dosoki, kopa bono nakachu, labora na winki smak toma, kuyami jusku chita nai. Uchiwa e aita kan kicha na chupor nipo, kun muli ra slimo poiwa. Ki muli ra kun kin. Uchiwa chau bas. Uchiwa penki. Don't call me to the bedroom to any become friends. I was fall for nice catch. Continue to struggle with the strength and message, and I only flirt with the bartender. You go up from the floor and pass it to my tail. You have a rest of sleep, but when you wake up, your head hurts and it's right for you to know what you did. Okay, well, that's. Ciao! 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 I think was one of these guys was supposed to talk to us. Game registered that were dark red, but so far it got the thing. Yeah, you got to go explore no plan for them to be like, hey, you're dark red. Man. You should go talk to this person, buy stuff. Now. Oh, there's a Civ Academy. I know, right? It's so lackluster compared to how it is in, you know, Star Wars of the Republic. We can Star Wars of the Republic. I like Carbon. Because it's simple. It's a decent starting zone, because it's simple. Everything's in its nice little zone. Like, this is the first zone, this is the second zone, this is the third zone, and this is the last zone. And then you leave. Simple, really. It's always a bit tedious, but it's not better than Now Hut or whatever. Didn't like Now Hut that much for the whole uh Sif a uh Imperial Agent and Bounty Hunter. Like, I like the Bounty Hunter and I really like the Imperial Agent. Like, the Imperial Agent is still probably one of the best storylines in Star Wars The Republic. Maybe a bit overrated, but still. But I'm still, you know, Sith Warrior is still my favorite storyline. The only problem with Corpan, though, is it's just. It's a bit barren, you could say. Now, how is more the swamps and going from point A to point B? But meh. But still, compared to this, this is just lackluster compared to the Star Wars The Republic's. I mean, I'm not being attacked by anything on the way the hell either. Anyway, we will deal with this shortly. Just need to pause the video. We go eat. Yay. Also, I want to point out, it took me a moment to realize, as I was in the video, that... Yeah, that's a thing. Apparently, we're being affected by... I think that's horror and slow. Yeah, we're being affected by horror and slow. It's like, should it really be lasting this long? Like, seriously. Touching my stats. Weird. Oh well, maybe I'll go away by the time we get back. Who knows? So I want to point out something. When the hell did I get fetched by horror? And slow? Because... We haven't been in a fight yet on... Or a pen. And we're just affected by such. 
And it's like, how do I get rid of it? You don't have to get rid of it. So... Huh. counter at the slow. Eh, sort of. Maybe, I'm not sure. When did I get those effects? Was it when I was fighting Dark Mallet? And they haven't gone away yet? Because that's surprising. I don't know what to do about that, like. Hmm. I can't look this up. Okay, apparently the internet's too stupid to figure out my issue. Yay! Please, don't hurt me. I am too weak with hunger. You think I'm getting Leave me be. Can't you see that I'm busy? No, you may not. I'm busy amusing myself, and I'm not going to miss any of the fun. Now get lost before I teach you a lesson. I could easily... Like, seriously, though, it's like we're just stuck with that. That's our time. Like, I don't... Like, it shouldn't be wearing off. It, it, it should, shouldn't it? Like, how far speed are I wore off? We're still stuck with horror, and... Versus how long have I had that? It's like... I... yeah, I can't tell from the save, so... Huh. Weird. Yeah, okay, so apparently just... Apparently hard and slowed. And apparently I can't do anything about that. You are neither a Sith, nor do you bear the medallion of... Yeah, well, I'm Dark Rebel. I see. And who might your friends be? Well, it's always dope. On your way. You are neither a... I have been conditioned... Please do not tell that. No one. Medallion. It is the device given to one who has been accepted into the Academy, but has not yet proved their worth as a student. If one of the Sith decides you are worthy, you will be given one. Which you must then take to Yathura Ban, who I believe is in the cantina. It is she who decides which hopefuls enter the academy. On your way. Okay. I still don't understand why we have you now. Just, well, just apparently hard and slowed. And I don't know how to fix that. I mean, I guess it's not as bad as having you. Negative armor rating, but still. It's affecting my dexterity, which is bad. I don't know how to remove it, which is bad. Oh, you're in hell. Hi. Is there something you need, Jedi? Make it good, for I have little patience. Sorry. Who am I? You must not have been in Korriban for very long. Either that or you have been feeling your way about blindly. Luckily for you, I am in a charitable mood. I am Yathura Ban, second only to Master Uthar of the Sith Academy here in Dresde. 
I am the one who decides which of the few of the many hopefuls who travel here to train actually become a Sith. Why? Is it your desire to enter the Academy? Is that why you are here? I would consider that an amusing ploy to try and enter the Academy. Why? Who will you claim to be? Darth Malak himself? What about Revan? Revan is dead. You may have a natural gift for the Force, human, but you've no gift for lies. You've heard enough, have you? <laughs> so what is it to be? Are you here to be a Sith or not? Yeah, sure, why not? Ah, so you are just another hopeful after all. Or are you? There is something odd about you that I cannot place. Obviously you are a Jedi. One who is very strong in the Force, it seems. So were you a part of the Order for very long? Did they train you? What an odd thing to say. And even stranger, I do not sense any deception within you. You are a curious puzzle, human. A puzzle with great power. With that kind of power, you could become a great Sith. Perhaps, if I let you. Does that interest you? Ah, good. Exactly the sort of answer I was hoping for. I will take you to the Academy. And we shall see if you are ready to join the ranks of the Sith. Are you ready to go there now? Oh, yeah, sure, why not? Then let us leave. The Master of the Academy awaits you. I didn't even have to get a medallion. I just got taken there. Stay away. Greetings, prospective students. It appears we have a late entry. Who do you bring before me, Uthura? A young human bristling with the Force? A human that has had some training, it seems, Master Uthar. Very promising, I think. I met this one in the colony. Unworthy, if you ask me. That I'll judge for myself, thank you. Tell me, human, what do you know of the ways of the Sith? What preconceptions has your mind been polluted with? <laughs> I know more about the Sith than you. I've just forgotten. Indeed. Then perhaps you would care to demonstrate for us the powers of a Sith Master. No? Then perhaps you shall keep your foolishness to yourself and actually well, learn something. Armor, the Jedi right? equate the light with goodness and strength, and the dark with weakness and evil. That is their tradition, and it is truly no surprise that they cling to it for comfort. We, however, do not treat the Force as a burden. We treat it as a gift, a thing to be celebrated. We use it to acquire power over others. And why should we not? Because the Jedi say we should not. We are as the Force is meant to be. The Jedi would hide that from you. They would tell you the dark side is too quick, too easy. All so that they need never challenge the passions that lie within them. Joining with us means realizing your true potential. It means not stifling yourself solely for the sake of hidebound shamans and their antiquated notion of order. Be what you were meant to be. What say you, Lasho? Are you ready to learn the secrets of the dark side? Dare you? I dare, Master Uthar. I am ready. Brash and fiery, as expected. Turn that passion to your advantage, child. What of you, Meikl? Are you ready? I am, Master. More than ready. I sense much anger within you, young one. That is good. That will provide you power. And Shardan, what of you? I am always ready. I see. You had best gather your wits for the trial ahead, boy, or you will not last. And you, young human, does this interest you? Are you ready to learn more of what I speak? And so shall it be. Now then, all of you five recruits have shown a degree of facility with the Force. You all have the potential to become true Sith. Only one of you, however, will succeed. The one who succeeds will be admitted to the Academy as a full Sith. All others must wait until next year and try again, if you survive. My pupil, Euthura, shall be your teacher and master while you attempt to prove yourselves. Heed her words. 
As Master Uthar said, none of you are true Sith yet. For that to occur, one of you must do enough of worth, gain enough prestige to be selected. What is an act of worth? You must learn that for yourselves. Remember that you are competitors here. Fight for your destiny, or go home. If you wish to gain a lead over your competitors, the first of you to learn the code of the Sith and tell me of it will be rewarded. The rest is for you to discover. Welcome to the dark side, my children. Your one chance at true greatness lies here. So, yeah. So we're still just gonna be affected by these. Yep, still just gonna be affected by these. Like, hell, but I know what to do about it. Now, what do you need for feeds? More demolition? Um, probably more go ahead. Oh, Star and Tower go ahead. Because he has. Nah, he's not going to get the feeds by level 20, though. Touch in a. I. Well, man. What do you need? Talk about what? The I'll understand. Yeah, I don't know what to do about that. It's bothering me, and I don't know how to remove it. Like, it, it should just. Uh, I by definition it should just, you know, expire, but it's not expiring, so not like we can, you know, bald escape rest and hope it goes away. Ah, there you are. My favorite prospect for the year. Favorite prospect? Absolutely. By my estimation, you are far more likely to achieve the prestige necessary to join the Sith than any of the others. As a matter of fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Would you like to hear it? Sure, why Good. I do so adore someone who's willing to take a chance. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. Once that occurs, he will take you into the Valley of the Dark Lords to the tomb of Nagasado to administer the final test. There you and I will be alone with him. The perfect time to, shall we say, arrange for a change in the Academy's leadership? So the tomb is an ancient ruin on the surface that was visited years ago by Darth Revan and Darth Malak. They discovered a star map there of great importance. Darth Malak went there? Very interesting, isn't it, Master? Reaching that map as they did is part of the final test. At any rate, it is not the tomb that is important. That Uthar will be alone is what is important. Oh, yeah, you want me to is that such a daunting prospect? It is not as if I am asking you to perform the task alone, or as if you will get nothing out of it. Master Uthar cannot prevail against us both. That's all there is to it. Well, it is a very simple matter. Against me alone, anyway. Eh, sounds familiar. And so it should. It is central to our beliefs. It is my responsibility to replace my master when I am strong enough. You're not strong enough. You need me to do it. My part in this is to help you gain enough prestige and slow down the progress of the other hopefuls. I want you in that tomb when the time is right. We destroy Master Uthar together and I take his place. And you take your place at my side. A beautiful plan in its sheer simplicity. Mm, very well. I'm so glad you see it my way. I will begin to make preparations for your final test. Your only worry now is to get there. Don't disappoint me. So I can help you understand it. Would you like to hear it? Peace is a lie. There is only passion. passion. Through passion, I gain passion. strength. Okay. Through strength, I gain power. I Through power, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. The Force shall free me. Simple words, yet easily misunderstood. 
The Jedi would have you believe that peace is a desirable goal. That peace of the spirit is the way the Force is mastered. That a lack of conflict betters man. We know different. It is our passion, our hate, and our desire that fuels the Force. It is conflict that improves the lot of civilization and single being both. Conflict forces one to better oneself. It forces change, growth, adaption, evolution, or death. These are not our laws, but the universe's. Without conflict, you have only stagnation. What fuels your power with the Force but your passion? The stronger, darker emotions. Anger, hatred, fear. These passions empower us. Love is more dangerous than all those things. Love leads to anger and hatred more often than not. But it also leads to mercy, which is far worse. That, however, is a lesson for another time. Negative? Compared to what? What keeps even the most rudimentary creature alive? Fear to run. Anger to fight. Without it, a creature would most surely die. It is our goal to be stronger, to achieve our potential and not rest upon our laurels. We are the Seekers, not the Shepherds. The stronger you become in the Force, the more power you will achieve. But always must you fight for your power. Without strife, your victory has no meaning. Without strife, you do not advance. Without strife, there is only stagnation. Yeah, but the problem though is there's a level cap, so... Eventually, it's gonna become a bit stagnant because I can't become more powerful. Because there, I can't level up anymore, so... <laughs> uh, it's fun seeing things through the eyes of someone who's played enough games. How many sorts of victories can you imagine? Peaceful victory, victory by sacrifice, a truce, an achievement. Unless the victory is achieved by demonstrating that your power is superior, it is only an illusion, temporary at best. We seek more. This has been argued over and often. The chains represent our restrictions, both those placed upon us and those we place upon ourselves. Ultimately, the goal of any Sith is to free herself from such restrictions. In a way, it is so we may do whatever we wish, but it is much more than that. One who has freed themselves from all restrictions has reached perfection, their potential fulfilled. Perfect strength, perfect power, perfect destiny. Imagine it. That is our ideal at any rate. It is said in Sith legend that the Sithari, the perfect being, will one day lead us. But perhaps that is just a legend. I wonder what that being would be like. The legends say the Sithari will destroy us and make us stronger than ever. But perhaps that is just a legend. No Perfection idea. is a goal, I think, rather than a state of being. The Jedi would argue that, no doubt. Anyway, I, think I am not surprised. The Force is strong with you. Master it and it shall serve you well. You must impress Master Uthar. Go to him with news of your deeds, or artifacts you have discovered. The Code of the Sith is the easiest way to start. I have told you all that you need to know of it already. There are a group of students who refused an order by Master Uthar to execute a group of civilians in the colony. Uthar declared that they were to be executed themselves, but the students escaped and fled before the order could be carried out. We are certain that they have not left Korriban. No doubt, if you no, were to no, locate I... them and carry out Uthar's order, I am sure he would be most appreciative. Of course he would. Shall I go on? Go on. I would suggest you talk to the other prospective Sith and find one you can gain an advantage with. I believe Lasho would be an excellent choice. She is too trusting. I have little doubt you could talk her into letting you help her somehow. Just make sure it is you who gains the advantage, not her. Be ruthless if you must. That is the only thing that will impress Uthar. Ten. The only other idea I can suggest to you is that you head into the Valley of the Dark Lords on the surface. There are ancient ruins there which can be explored. Ten. It's possible you might find some artifacts or information in them which would please Uthar. It's difficult to say for certain. 
So, what do you know about Darth Revan? Revan? You mean Darth Malak's former master? Uh, that's the one. Very little. I never met him personally, though I heard he was a very powerful man. Very charismatic. In the end, Revan was outshone by his pupil. Such is the way of the Sith. Why? Is this dead man of importance to you? Anything is possible. Uthar's former master still lives, though he is in no condition to challenge his former pupil for leadership. Perhaps the same is true for Revan. Perhaps Revan is out there, somewhere, waiting to take revenge upon Malak. More Malik. likely, what we were told is the truth. Revan is dead. Malak would be foolish to leave his old master alive, considering all the knowledge Revan held. Is there any reason I should? Beside the fact I did not know Revan in life, Revan was known for wearing a full helmet and cape. Perhaps Revan's body had been disfigured by the power of the Force. It is not unheard of. Regardless, I doubt I shall be meeting Revan any time soon. Fair enough. What tell me about, about myself? I am originally from Slaheron, if you must know. I was a slave to a cruel master, Omish the Hutt. I'm sure you don't need to know more. Oh, okay. You have had an excellent start. Go, gain more prestige. 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 Also, game of being constantly affected by this stupid horror. <laughs> I don't know what to do about it. It won't go away. It won't go away. No problem. Got it. Well, let me just break into the master's room. Then take this day pad. And look at this day pad. Day pad? Day -da pad. Have ever versus contained hey, numerous entries are known by the Sith Master uh, Ufo of the Sith Academy. Much from the following entries is the following. If you ever know which Dasha has shown remarkable progress, and down the force is great. Same how it cannot be said for the human female that I arrived with, Celine. She has her talent moreover. Does her hopes a great of different fashion for her. This is the this is a weakness in the boy and has been so many times training. Horde was sent this morning. Had to go remove from the academy and terminate. How it does her that she can the vow he will forget soon enough, I think, is too promising to lose it. You know, just don't you? No problem. Oops. Got it. Oh, he has a giant master rope, massive mask. Oh, to this bed. It's like, why can't I sell up the bed? If I can't do anything with the bed. Oh, to Sith master rope. Or Sith mask. Yet, mind affecting and bonus feats and lightsaber, and you regenerate force points. So it's useless. So, I still don't know what to do about that. Who the hell are you? Oh, uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Algwin. Something wrong. I, oh, uh, nothing. Are you sure? Uh, yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't, you know. But I'm not. Can't persuade you to uh, me. no, no, I really can't. A, a Sith, like you, would use any means to succeed. But I'm not Sith. Oh, I know that. I mean, you aren't yet, but you intend to be. I mean, you're just like everyone else here. And you're not. Well, I, I, I didn't mean it like that. Well, how did you? I, I, I shouldn't trust you. I, I can't trust you. Can I? Oh, you want to trust me. I just me. don't feel I belong here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now I... I don't know. I have so many doubts. Is that it? Yes, I'm... I, I, I'm sorry. Please, don't, don't tell anyone. I'll get over it, I guess. I... I am too a Sith. I'm more a Sith than you are. I'll show you. Cute. Hmph! 
So, no yeah, problem. Gonna be Got it. Throwing their disadvantage, apparently. And I have no idea what to do about it. That's a high safeguard. Greetings, student. Oops. You? I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it into the academy. Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> it just so happens that I have a surefire way of pulling ahead in this little contest of ours. You don't really have a chance. Oh, really? Why, why is that? I found an artifact that will impress Uthar far more than anything you could ever scrounge up. I'll win for sure. And why are you brought I don't have it just yet. I'll get it when I'm good and ready. God it isn't. So what if it is? I'll get it eventually, regardless. Nothing good comes without a bit of a fight. That's the Sith motto, more or less. Well, maybe I, could help you hmm. I suppose I could use some help. The artifact I know of certainly won't be easy to take. But why should I work with you? Flattery, is it? <laughs> I suppose it's possible that Master Uthar could award both of us prestige. We'd be ahead of the others, for sure. Unfortunately, the Holocron lies in the gullet of a Tukata mother. I can arrange for us to meet her, but you're going to have to help me in putting her down. That makes sense to you? Go into the valley when you're prepared enough. I'll be amongst the central pillars near the north end. Because it probably contains secrets from the time when the Sith ruins on this planet first existed. You don't think that Master Uthar would find that impressive? That. Remember, the central pillar's in the valley. I'll be waiting, so don't take too long. I still don't understand this. Like... Kotar? Debuff constantly, constantly active on main character. Now who? Maybe some of the glitches. Cause it's like. It's like I look at this and it's like, nope. Like I said, I don't know why I would have to search for to figure out this shit. So I got the page to load. And we found a shooter. I should. I remember you. You're all right. Trying for the academy, I see. So you are That's there. true. I had no idea you were coming for the Academy when I met you in the colony, though. There you the name's Shardan. Didn't I tell you that back in the colony? No, you're too busy Maybe not. Making... I don't work or play well with others. Thanks for the offer, though. Okay. So glitches, glitches, glitches. I start spinning. I am. Yeah, okay, this doesn't help me at all. Ugh. So, yeah, we're just permanently stuck like this, apparently. I don't know what to do about it. It's like I could reload, but I don't think that's just gonna get rid of it, so. 
It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've got it all wrapped up. You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something? Maybe. I could, but what would be the oh. point in that? See you around, chump. Cute, cute. I put that in consideration. Dustel. Yeah, what if I? No, I don't think reloading is gonna fix it. But what if we try to reload? Nope, we're still cursed. We're still cursed. Ah. Uh, you take a wrong turn somewhere? Dustal, is that you? Oh, lovely. It's father. Figures you'd show up after all this time. How, How did you, you manage to get inside worries. the academy? Carf, why is your son Rosh Pannon? <laughs> and I'm supposed to believe that my self-righteous father has fallen into the habit of accompanying Sith in their training? I doubt that. Just why are you here, father? Not for me, I hope. Couldn't you have gotten yourself blown up on some ship and spared us this reunion? Dustle, what, what, what are you talking about? I, I thought you were dead. Too bad you didn't still think that. Or did you really think I'd be happy to see you? Look, everyone, it's father. Come to rescue me at long last. Sure, he may have left mother and I to die on Telos, but that doesn't matter. No, I didn't abandon you. The task force just arrived too late. Telos was in ruins, and your mother... I, mean, I held her while... But I looked for you. I swear, I looked everywhere. Ah, oh, save it. You abandoned us long before. We were alone all during the wars. And even once you came back, you still didn't stay. I didn't have a choice. I was needed at... Yeah? Well, you were needed at home, too. You were needed when the bombing started, and I got captured. You know what? It doesn't matter. Not anymore. I have a new family now. A family that cares about me. I don't need you. Help. The Sith? You can't mean that. No, the Sith killed your mother. The Sith destroyed Telos. So? You're the soldier, father. How many mothers have you killed? No, you've been brainwashed. The son I knew would never... You never knew me. You weren't even there to know me. So don't presume to tell me what I would or wouldn't do. I don't know what's been done to you, but you are coming with me out of here now. Touch me, old man, and I'll kill you. Get out! Get out of here before I tell the Sith that you're here. Okay, boys, all grown up. Aren't... Shut up! Stay out of this! Is that all you do? Give out orders? Well, you can't show up after all this time and expect to give me orders. I'm not your soldier, and I'm sure as hell not your son. Stop it, Dustal. Stop it. I won't let you go on like this. What have they done to you? They gave me a life, old man. They gave me power. You? You didn't even give me so much as a second's notice. No, no. That's not true. I was there when you were younger, but I had to leave to fight. I fought for you, for your freedom. No, you didn't. You fought for yourself, for glory. Well, the Sith can do that, too. We learn to fight and to kill. You want to see what I've learned, father? No, Dustal, don't. I don't... Too late, old man. You should have left when you had the chance. Yeah! Oh, yeah. Sorry, I did all I could, and I, I failed you. <laughs> okay, well, uh, that went a bit more messed up than I thought. Also, oh, was yours, Dusto? He has a universal computer interface. Maybe he was a droid in disguise. <laughs> well, that's well, that's definitely messed up. Messed up. Yes, what's on your... So... Th there's nothing to talk yeah. about. I, I failed my son, just as I failed my wife. I thought I've ever found him. I, I just can't believe he's dead. I'm not... You should have stopped him. You should have done something to prevent this. <sighs> oh, don't give me that innocent look. You can talk a hut out of his credits. You could have found a way... You could have saved him. See, Carper's right. I could have saved him. I can't help but wonder if part of you didn't enjoy this. I, mean, I thought we might be friends, but with you, uh, <laughs> who can tell? All the blame? No, part of the blame, no. Part of the blame is yours. The rest is mine. I wish we hadn't come. I, I, I wish I'd never found him.
Yeah, I'm sorry too. And I'm sorry I ever met you. I... no. I didn't <laughs> mean okay, that. Please. God. Maybe it would be better if we just continued with the mission. I wanna... take my mind off this. Saving the galaxy is what's important now. My son, I... I can mourn my son later when we're done. So let's just go. Oof. Yes, what's... If you're ready to talk, then yes. So am I. And? I can't hate you. I tried. I wanted to hold you responsible for all the things you've done for my... for my wife, for Telos, for Dustal. But I can't. Well, you did name him Dustal, so... I got the revenge I always wanted when Saul died. But it hasn't brought me the peace that I thought it would. You have a darkness inside you that must be Revan. But there's more to you as well. I see it. I know it's there. That's why I can't hate you. Why I don't want any more revenge. You don't have to be Revan. You can be so much more. Whatever the Jedi did to you, they gave you that chance. Whatever's happened up until this point, there's going to come a time very soon where you're going to have to make a choice. And there won't be any turning back. Great. Have I make the wrong choice? Well, then I hope I can save you from yourself. No, you can't. Cause that's the problem with this game though. It doesn't understand neutral evil. They only understand it's basically they put everything in way too black and white. Like Jolie's a good example of a grey character. Like he doesn't really care though. Like he's just sort of there. The whole thing is just trying so hard to make everything seem good and evil. Like Ugh. Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little prestige. You will have to work quickly if you hope to best the others. Yeah, yeah. Oh? What is my apprentice up to now? I see. It is good that you have come to me with this information, young one. It is a bit... ironic that Euthura has begun her plotting. I have been aware of her growing ambitions for some time and had in fact already decided to remove her. Normally, the one who gains the most prestige would engage in a final trial. Two of the students would fight. This time, it will be Euthura who battles, though she does not yet know it. Perhaps it will be you who combats her. Yes, perhaps so. This is what you can do. Give this pad to Adrenus. He will put some poison in her bath. This will weaken Euthura for that final test, making her an easy target. Rather generous of me, don't you think? I'd love to know what's going on in that tricky mind of yours. For coming to me with this information and betraying your foolish trainer, I feel you are worthy of prestige, young one. Yeah, Go so now. Much. You have not yet impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Then finish the code as I speak it. Peace is a lie. That is only... Through passion, I gain... Through strength, I gain. Through power, I gain. Through victory, the Force shall free me. Yes, good. That's you have indeed learned the code of the true, Sith. Okay. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, however, two different things. Tell me then, true or false? It is our passion that fuels the Force. Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me. Very well. I'll be on my way then. Who the hell are you? Oh wait, did I finally... I finally am free. The force has set me free. I finally no longer... I guess maybe it was stuck and I need to go into combat to lose it. And since we did defeat Dustel, we're finally free of that. Well, that's great. Huh. Maybe you can do better than I. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. Trying I'm to... trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. 
too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been madly. How do you drive? Just activate the console. It gives you a variety of options for serum dosage. The right amount applied at the right rate should do it. The real trick is that the only way to gauge your progress is to watch the prisoner closely for his reaction. Our scanners can't pick up his vitals. Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. He's supposed to be questioned, not executed. Oh, if you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll be sure to pass on the good word to Master Yutha. Zap. We eat a non dieta. What are you, ma? Wama hoo nan dick. Ah, shotungi patoga. Wano kuzbe. Yeah. Can't do it. Pudu! Run a noop. Cabo do baku. Paliamu. As are you. Okay, fine. How do you wish to use a car shop? Oh, not a chut. Okay. Keep. A chuta. Tune a chut. Keep. Tune a chut. Mucha hatunga ya fulke. Chachiska do punta. Yes, I heard that. Excellent job. Thank you for locating the cash. Naturally, I would see you rewarded, but I would prefer that everyone believe that I extracted the information. Oh? I suppose one would need to be alive to go running to Master Yutha to report the location of the cash, wouldn't they? Does that mean that you're ready to battle a true Sith then? Shall we make an issue of it? Well, come ha. on then. Gather your anger then, and let us see who is superior. Yes, who is superior? Who is superior? But your mind is puppies now. Your mind is nothing but puppies. Ooh. That's Okay. Okay. Not have green crystal. Ah, uh, fun times. So, you serious in your script? Yes, you are. Good. Yes? Stop doing the... I do. Oh, look how weak you are. If you're here to use the dueling room, go ahead. I'm through with it for the moment. Why do you all look about the same hairstyle as Bill? No, exactly. Maybe. No pr Sorry, I don't have time to speak. My training waits. Nice <laughs> competitor. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Boop. Boop. Back at the carriage day for hours. No way. Farts of interest. Yeah, I'm just wasting spikes. Yay. So, can we put on a camera sentry for it's not a target? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. So, I can just murder them that way? Okay, fine. No problem. Got it. Go away. 
There's nothing we need to talk about. Do not forget our... Yeah, no, you no. do? That is most interesting. Where might that be? Hmm. How ironic that I recently had his vessel scrapped for parts then. I had assumed it had been thoroughly scanned. Apparently not. Still, you have done well in bringing... Go now. You have done... Okay. You have... Your game procedures were not enough. I think that there's a door behind us on the way out. So we'll go this way instead. Yeah! Huh. Another hopeful wandering about the Academy? <sighs> I suppose you want to know how to get prestige. No, I don't <laughs> I doubt like I don't really need your help, I could go find prestige out anywhere. Cause so, yeah. And you don't really need to do all the quests. Who are you though? Wanga kun beast kin ba mula rak choni yun tun gigi ida duana. Can chop a chawi, tea chop twist, yun kun. What do yama kama wuna hen at neck? Tea kun ta do kun ta krita. A tea kondo una chaba chisa wanki. Bona na kachu. Picha badwang. Wang ki tea men bon rang thong. Muli ra un shad furring um ni patoka wanga chan zi tse. Run. Achuta. Tolpa da bongwale gandu nangugu. Oh, akupa che kupa. Gino mulera ke paja. Ka chi kun ida haldonga. I'm actually gonna loot this person. No problem. Got it. Okay, so go to the valley. Yay, the valley of the Dark Lords. Did I say Dark Lords or Dark Lords? <laughs> anyway. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Ah, uh, yeah, ah, uh, this is what I was thinking of. I was thinking of the frickin' Shyrax, not the Micros. <laughs> Time to rumble! <laughs> oh, there was actually I no longer need Carf. Because Carf's story's done. So let's bring back him. And level them up. And powers. What you got? Force armor? Oh, you haven't gained war one yet. Or that, actually. Oh, snap, you have two points. I didn't even realize that. My bad. <laughs> oh, next time you'll be getting four storm. What? Snapping everyone. Zappity zappity. And the Shira Caves. Which are more involved in the second Kotar. Shira. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what you got. I still got it. What 
don't want points in. Uh, let's see, powers, powers. I don't really have my levers left to really gain much powers. Sadly. Because I have really one more level. I can try it now. From those, these caves are entirely too large. Like, entirely too large. Better than Just the force for the man I did. We were knocking him around with force wave and insanity was kicking in. More Shyrax. Shyrax. I Shyrax. Here! <laughs> Cave is the easiest and nice for a service event. Nothing for you to see. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. This place here is more important to go to, too. Because then this is just not fine. But there are remains here. With Crowdroma robes and Duron's journal. The Crowdroma robes are worth your time? No, 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 they're not. But anyway, no, day pad, day pad. This day pad appears to be the personal journal of the Jedi Duo on Code Realma. Last century, he fears the boy receiving this world. Corvo is everything I imagined and feared. I can feel the power of the dark side here. I can sense the tower in Todd Tech hiding in this evil place. Shall I? Shall I? Shall I? I have decided to venture forth into the power of the Sith Lords in search of the creatures. I wish Gun Hunter was still with us. Why can't we just accept that Shall and I are in love? Place our patch reach out will us down the dark side. Why can't we see how his own pride and arrogance will leave him away from the light? Maybe it's good that he left after all. He runs dangerous as a terror attack arm, so then Shall I could defeat one of our help. And then you were dead. So the crowd drama robes. Yeah, see the problem here? They're not bad robes. But they're restricted to the light side. <sighs> That's the problem with Jedi things. Like it's a it's a unique robe. But it's light side only. That's one of the fun things. There's not really many things that are just, you know, 
neutral. Is it for light side or dark side? So that's why in Star Wars The Republic, like, you can't really go neutral. You had to be light side or dark side. Patrick. But that was mostly just for, you know, uh, what was it? That's an average one, isn't it? Is there a can't pick up an average one? Well, at least I don't really feel like switching to my gloves, so yeah. What? Yeah, and so we're so public. It was mostly, um. Uh, relics and stuff. Yes? I remember, right, that we're like, oh, wow, you probably Master? Dark Five of this. Again, Dark Five used to be easy, like. It used to be a lot easier than they made it now. Because basically, what you would do is you would basically. Because Dark Five used to be, what, like, only 10,000? Dark Side? Or is it 100,000? Basically, all you do is you go to like the Black Town Flash Point, and you would solo that over and over and over again. Like what, two thousand Dark Side points each run? If you made the right what? choices, so yeah, you just do that several times until you've maxed out. It's not terrible. Now it's like you've got so much more Dark Side. And it's tedious. Hold it right there, whoever you are. We're, we're not going back to the Academy. We'll kill you rather than go back. Well. Wow. Guess we do this the hard way. Open then. fire! Get them! Get them! Tail is a Yusani doing shield. Cute. Not bad, actually. Brand new and such. Very good for this fine now. I just don't want to feel bothered to deal with it. Okay, so the problem is I'm still searching over there. Say about Skyrax. That's not really that impressive. That just sort of exists. Sort of the thing. Johnny's very handy in the force. I kind of am glad we saw Sam to you, Jay Sif, uh, Jay Droid support. Because here's the thing most characters aren't exactly fit for doing that. Like, I'm pretty sure Basil will be running out of force, Johnny definitely running out of force. But he, he has enough force that he could just be tossing everything around. I'm trying to think if I want in the video or not. You know what? Hell is in the video. Hell. So anyway, next time we go and explore the Valley of the Dark Lords. Hope you love.
enjoyed. Thank you all, and have a nice day.